Hello, this is an easy tutorial for how to paint and draw a lizard for kids. This is the second animal tutorial for kids. I will link the first in the description. So here I have drawn an outline in pencil of our lizard. It's basically just a spiral with a head. So first I'm going to draw the eye, the outline, and then I'm going to draw different spots around it. So alternating between circles and semicircles. So it's gonna be two in each. So now I'm going to do it all over the body. Remember, this spiral. is your painting, so you can make the patterns however you want them to be. So you don't have to do circles, you could do hexagons or triangles or com completely different shapes. You don't have to do circles. So now we're ready to do some painting. I've chosen blue here. Um, I'm doing um, the body in blue because I think it's quite a nice and vibrant color. It doesn't matter what paint you use. It can be acrylic or watercolor. Don't worry if you make any mistakes. It really just doesn't matter. I'm using a watercolor here. Also, if you go into the pencil lines like I have here, um, don't worry because we're going to cover that up with a different colour. I'm planning on doing a bit of a gradient here, which means um, I might do some light to dark. So I start off quite dark here at the head uh, of the lizard, but on the, at the end I'll have a much lighter shade of blue. You don't have to do this, it is optional. Next we're going to grab a coloured pen or pencil and colour in the first circle. 
So not the second circle, just the outside circle of the two circles we've done in the pattern. Unless you've done a different pattern, that is. You can choose any colour, I've just chosen this greenish turquoise because it goes with my blue but you may have chosen orange to go with maybe your yellow body. Now we're going to fill in the center circles or the center of whichever shape you've chosen. If you've done hexagons, then you're filling in the center hexagon. And I've chosen yellow, this fluorescent yellow, because I think it adds a bit of vibrancy to this funky lizard. But you don't have to do yellow. You can do green or blue or orange. It's completely up to you. We're almost finished, we're just going to do the second last step now, which is the eye. So just put a little dot in the centre of your two circles. I chose the colour of the body, but you don't have to. And this is the last step, I'm just doing a quick outline of, in blue of my lizard. Just to give it some definition, and so that it's really clear, and that if there was a bit of paint that went outside the lines, I can have a th thicker outline so that it doesn't go through, um, it doesn't go outside the lines. And once you've done that, you're finished. Thank you for following on along to this tutorial and I hope you enjoyed it.